Hi, I'm David and welcome to Leisure Bit. And today we're coming to you from Stanick Park in Cumbria. So let's go and take a look around. Pick up our journey on the Carlisle North turn off of the M6 and then we head down the 689 round the Carlisle Bypass. After a little way we come to the A595 signposted Workington and we take that road. We could get out of town, see the beautiful world around, wanna see it now. Pack our bags and get in. When we got to Aspatria, we took a right-hand turn, signposted Silleth. You then follow the road for eight or nine miles, then you come out just near Stanix Park. We checked in at reception and we were given our wristbands. We then headed round to our pitch, which was on the Skidor touring area of Stanix Park. We're just passing the Leisure Centre main complex on the right and we're going to take a left hand turn here. On the road with a couple of tunes in a car for two. As well as touring pitch, the site has a number of statics which are either owned or rental, as well as some other accommodation. We're now entering the Skidor touring section of Stanick Park. There's another touring area called Criffel. We chose to stay in Skidor because it's the one we'd previously stayed at and it brought back some nice memories. There's around 30 pitches in this section of the park and that includes some pods. We couldn't believe it, we were the only ones in this section of the campsite. Brilliant! When we were last here, I don't think there was a free pitch. That's us pitched up, we were on 122, it was slightly sloping so we needed to use the levelling ramps and on the pitch there was electric hookup at 10 amps and also water. Still couldn't get over that we were the only people in this section of the site. When you check in you're given a little tag to put on your windscreen just that they know you've paid and when your departure date is. Let's take a look from above. Let's have a peek over the trees. You can see the park and the sea in the distance from here. Let's continue our look around the touring area. So there's rubbish and recycling. There's a gents and a ladies toilets. Let's have a quick peek inside. The toilets and showers were really clean and tidy. There was also accessible facilities within the toilet block. You could even have a bath if you fancied it. You're given a code which you enter on the keypad to access the toilet block. There's also a washing up area. and a chemical toilet disposal point. Let's take a wander now to the other area of the park near the main complex. There's an outdoor swimming pool here. Maybe not so good for this time of the year though. There's crazy golf. And here's the Criffle touring area. There's a laundry here with commercial washers and dryers. Little more look now around the Criffle touring area.
There was an outdoor bar as well. This was new since we were last here, but it was only open on a weekend. We're off to find the beach now, come with us. Roxy thoroughly enjoyed her time on the beach. It's a hello from me and Roxy on a very deserted beach. Back from the beach now and back on Stanick Park. Let's take a wander now to the main complex. It's only a couple of minutes walk from the Skidar touring area to the main complex. As you go in there's a reception and then on the left hand side there's a shop which is well stocked with food and drink and various gifts and things. There's the garden cafe on the ground floor. Also on the ground floor, there's a number of gaming machines. If you wander around towards where the main entertainment is on an evening. There's a solarium and a gym. Then there's a swimming pool area, which also contains a jacuzzi, a steam room, a changing room, a foot spa, some heated lounges, there's even a slide. Let me give that jacuzzi a go. The jacuzzi was lovely and hot and the water in the pool was perfect for swimming in. There's a seating and viewing area above the pool. You can also find the entrance to June's Cabaret Bar here. There's often evening entertainment in June's Cabaret Bar. Let's take a quick peek in. Let's head across to Sky Bar now. I can feel a thirst coming on. Cheers. Cheers. So let's now take a look at the Astro Bowl and the amusement and soft play area. So we're just in the garden cafe at uh, Stanick Park. Very nice. We used to come here uh, many years ago, about 15 years ago with Jessica. Um, it was her favorite site of all time. So we decided to come back and give it another go. And it hasn't changed much in that time. It's brilliant. We treat ourselves to an evening meal in the cafe Rachel had the scampi and I had the macaroni cheese and both were lovely. Alas, our break was coming to an end and the weather had taken a turn for the worse as well.
but we were due to move on today. This was really a last minute thing we'd picked. Just time for some breakfast and then a quick final look around and then we were on our way. But we decided to book up again for November as we'd really enjoyed it. 